In this video, we're gonna go over how to set up a YouTube channel and why it's important, okay? So I have my channel up right now. You can see there's a few things that I've done to it that I want you guys to go out there and do to your YouTube channels. Okay, treat YouTube as an extension of your website. You wanna brand it, you wanna have links out to your website, you wanna use it as an asset. Okay, a lot of companies set up their YouTube channel and they just don't use it like they need to. So I wanna show you how to set it up and then why it's important. So first thing you wanna do is get your icons, get your branding, get your logos, get your value proposition. Don't just throw up any old image here. So here's the difference. You have this channel right here that's all set up or you can take a look at this channel that is not. Okay, you'd be surprised how many big companies have their channels that just are not set up. So first thing you wanna do is hook up your website. Over here, you can see I have a link to my website. I have a link to my social media. You'll wanna do that. You can do that by just editing. There's a little icon that will pop up when you're logged in and you can edit your links. Make sure you have your channel art up. Okay, have your value proposition there and then also a link out. <clears throat> okay, that's first things. Next thing you can do is jump over into your channel and here you will find, you have to go to video manager. Over on the left hand side of your channel, there's a bunch of options that you wanna take advantage of. In your advanced, you can link up your AdWords account, then you can link up your associated website. On top of that, you have channel recommendation, subscriber count, okay? There's branding, do that. Featured content, you'll wanna fill all this out, okay? Upload defaults, this can just save you time if you wanna link out to all your, have the same hashtags or have the same social media links. And then status feature, you can, there's a few things you'll wanna do in here, okay? So that is how you set up correctly. Now remember, when you upload your videos, so let's go to this one. Make sure you have a good dis title tag, make sure you have a good description, make sure you have the right keyword tags. When you upload a video, if you don't fill these things out and do it correctly, it's kind of a waste. You might as well take advantage of it, okay? And something that came out in the last little bit are what's called these end screen annotations. You can set up an end screen, like if you just go over here and click and say, okay, I want another video to pop up. You can put create, let Google choose it, create element, and then you'll have an end screen pop up. Got it? That's something you can do, and it works on mobile. Before annotations only worked on desktop, now they work on mobile. So take advantage of all that. Now let's recap. So first thing you wanna do is make sure your channel has, I'm not gonna save that right now. Make sure your channel has the icon, cover photos, all your links. When you upload a video, use the right title tag, description tags, then on top of that, underneath your channel on video manager. So if you go to video manager, you have these options over here that you might as well take advantage of, the feature content branding in advance. Got it? If you have any questions, um, we're around, you can go check out our website, Marketing High with a YHY.com or YDraw.com if you're looking for an animation video Okay, I also provide a lot of other tutorial videos that are kind of based off of video marketing. Got it? Thanks for listening. Subscribe to our channel. Let us know if what you would like. If we're not shooting something that you're trying to find the answers to, we'd be happy to help out any way we can. And sign off.